What's up guys, Justin Eagle here, and this is Empty Theater Reviews. Yes, this is the first one. This is kind of something I'm doing uh, just for fun. I've been seeing a couple movies lately, and I thought, you know, hey, I could be a good critic. I could review for movies pretty well, so I'm just gonna have some fun. This is just a video for me to have some fun, enjoy a movie, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. I hope it makes you laugh, and uh, enjoy the show. And yes, guys, for empty theater reviews. The theater is empty. I'm the only one in here. I paid 500 bucks to buy this theater out. That's not true. I just come when nobody's here Wednesday nights. You gotta show up when nobody's here because that's when it's the best. And uh, yeah, guys, I'm just gonna have some fun and I hope you enjoy it. start that war. What's up guys? I don't know if you can hear me or even see me, but the movie we're seeing today is Kong Skull Island. And I heard it's good. I heard it's kind of funny. So I'm going to take a look. I'm going to watch it. I'm going to see how funny it is. I'm going to see how awesome it is. Lots of action. And then I'm going to tell you what I think about it at the end. That was the best part. Sony, Ultra K, whatever. It was awesome. It's about to get lit up in here. Oh my gosh, this dude just caught a blade with his bare hands. Like that was a smart thing to do. What's up guys? Okay, so obviously I can't show the movie that much um, because I'm not supposed to do that. Um, but I'm just gonna kinda just talk about what's happening occasionally and then I'll, at the end I'll summarize and tell how I feel about it and maybe I'll give it a little rating out of five stars because I'm pretty good at reviewing movies and I think I'm a good critic so uh, I don't know let's see what happens what's up guys okay so things are getting crazy they're starting to go onto the island they planned it all out it's time to infiltrate the island and uh, so far it's, it's been pretty good it's pretty entertaining and uh, John Goodman kills it, Samuel L. Jackson kills it. Uh, it's been pretty good so far. So let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, they just made it onto the island past the storm. Kong's not happy, he's here. And he's 100% fired up, he's lit. And he's not too happy about these intruders. It's getting crazy. I'll catch up with you in a minute. What's up guys? Okay, little update. Things is getting crazy. A bunch of people went down. But uh, they're at the part where the dude from Step Brothers comes out. Yeah, John C. Riley. He's in this movie. Uh, he's from the movie Step Brothers. He's also in Talladega Nights. Funny guy. And there he is. No, 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 no need for that. Come on now. Everybody keep your wigs on now. <laughs> I want to watch this. Holy crap. What's up guys? Yeah, oh my gosh, what a mighty conclusion to Kong the Skull Island. Um, this was actually a good movie. It was better than I was expecting it to be. John C. Riley, he had a bigger part um, than I thought he would. And uh, it was actually pretty awesome. Now a lot of people died, a lot of people uh, uh, went down. And that's kind of a part of it with an action flick. But the thing is, Kong was actually like a good guy. He was like a good person in the movie. And that's what shocked me the most. It was, was Kong wasn't fighting the people entirely. He wasn't fighting this, he was fighting this other monster that was inhabitant of uh, his land. And um, the movie's crazy. It was a great movie. They had a scene after the credits. It kind of insinuated that there's other monsters out there that Kong wasn't the king and I don't know it was just crazy and it was like it was like Godzilla is gonna be in the sequel like they're like some fire breathing dragon is what they were insinuating so it's a crazy movie um 
definitely worth watching if you're thinking about going and seeing it. Um, I know it's going to be out of theater soon, so if you want to go see it, definitely check it out soon. And uh, yeah, guys, it's a great movie. If I had to give it a rating, I would give it... It's hard. This is my first time rating movies, so I'm going to give it three and a half stars out of five. That's being a little generous, but um, it had a lot of leading actors in it, like Samuel L. Jackson and uh, John C. Riley, and then like other people. So it was a really great movie. And uh, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the show, and I hope you enjoyed my review. If you're new to my channel, definitely subscribe. Hit that like button, leave me a comment, and uh, yeah, guys, have a great night. I've got a fever, and the only prescription is more who fever. Let's get it. What's up guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, you know, when I come to the movies, uh, I've just been seeing a couple of movies lately and I thought it was important to document. Um, so this is kind of just a time for me to have fun, um, but also give uh, the movie a rating. So I hope you enjoyed the show and I appreciate you for watching. And uh, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this, I'll probably see some more movies in the future, maybe document some more. Um, but it was a great time, great movie, and I hope you enjoyed the show. You guys have a great night.